Guys, this is your new steering wheel. Look at this and check this out. This is the brand new Lincoln L100. Look, I'm gonna show you the coolest features of this car. The light goes all the way from the front, wraps around the side of the car. Look at this, a continuous line all the way around. Look how long this car is, six meters long. It keeps going, keeps going around the back. Come check this out. How beautiful is this? And then around here, all the way around. These wheels, so cool. So what this does is, this shows you the state of charging. This is a fully electric vehicle of the future. Look at this. And Greyhound set like an art piece behind the glass. The design of this car is meant to be as aerodynamic as possible. So you don't want something in the way sticking on the car right here. So they've actually put it behind the glass, which I think is just beautiful. It's like a little piece of art in a glass box at a museum, right? All right, now we're getting to the exciting stuff. We're going to open her up. I've never seen this before in my life. Check this out. <laughs> Look at this. So <laughs> it's like the car is giving you a hug, right? You're coming in, you walk up to the car and it's like, come on in, welcome home. So come on in guys, I need to show you what is happening inside. This is so freaking cool. All right, now the first thing you're gonna see is the floor of the car. Look at this. The whole floor is a screen the whole way back. So it kind of wraps you in whatever atmosphere you feel like being wrapped in in the moment. It can be, you know, ocean waves, it can be a field of poppies, whatever mood you're in. You could be in a concert, you know, if you want to you pump the music, you've got the crowd beneath you on the floor. Now here, what do you do with this, right? I've been carrying this around. This is your steering wheel, because as you can see, look, no steering wheel. This is fully autonomous. And this car is to celebrate 100 years of Lincoln. So back in 1922, that is when they first launched the Model L. Hence, this being called the L100. So it's, it's a nod to their history. And now 100 years later, the L100. Right, let me show you where this goes. Come on in, come on in. It feels weird actually putting your feet on screens. When do you ever put your feet on screens? It's like sit like standing on a TV screen. This is so cool. Look how massive it is, right? You can, you can really relax in this car. So this is really about the car driving you around. But if you want to drive it yourself, as I said, this is your steering wheel. You can pop this here. Okay. That's, oh, look. Did you see that? Did you see that? This thing actually like, responds to the car being put on this screen. It is so freaking cool. So what I can do is I pick this up and I'm like, right, I want to go to my first destination. And I just pull that forward. Watch. And it's like, right, I'm going to take you there. So then you put the car back here and off you go. And it takes you to where you want to go. So the inspiration came from someone just playing with their little toy cars at home as a lot of us do. And they're like, well, everyone loves playing with toy cars. So why can't we have a toy car actually operate a real car in real life, which I think is so freaking cool. So that's what that does. I just think that is so innovative. I've never seen anything like it. So we'll put that back there for safekeeping. All of these windows can tint to a level where you are in complete darkness here in the cabin. And then all you've got is this beautiful lighting from the floor. Now in the back, let me show you. Look at this. Just look how easy it is to get in here. I'm literally just standing in the back. But the cooler thing is this transforms. Check this out. Because it's an autonomous car, obviously you don't need a driver, right? So the, dr the people in the front can sit towards the passengers in the back and now you've got this kind of wraparound lounge effect, 
which I think is pretty cool, right? I mean, I feel like this is a, a theme of future cars, uh, that the, the, the front can turn to face the back passengers, because I suppose there's no reason to be facing the front if no one's driving. Uh, so you can just face the back and like have a bit of a chit chat with your friends. This is really gonna be, I mean, let's see if it ever really comes to life, whether this is what people want in the future or not, who knows? But it seems to be the way we're heading is, you know, we, we don't need someone driving the car, so let's just enjoy the ride, you know? And, and I don't know what, uh, I don't know, it's just so weird. I, I, I'm, once we get there, we'll understand <laughs> the purpose of it and how we actually get around like this. But I mean, I suppose it makes sense. But having, being driven backwards, maybe that's gonna be an issue for some people, but we'll see. Speaking of materials, this is quite cool. This is recycled suede and the designer was actually like, um, smell it. I was like, what? Sorry, I've never smelled. What am I doing? So I sniffed it. It actually smells quite good. He's like, I told you. There you go. So recycled suede, who knew? Jump in and we'll see what it feels like when the door's closed. It's a massive door, hey? Look how huge it is. It's quite cool though, isn't it? It's like you can, all of the passengers can walk in at the one time through the same entrance. You don't have to be like fiddling with various doors and stuff. Ooh. <laughs> Here we go. Look at that. It's actually quite nice. It's very calming actually. It doesn't feel like you're in a car anymore in these future cars. No one's driving, you've got screens everywhere. I mean, I just, I don't know, I don't know. I think, I, I mean, obviously I think it's beautiful. They've done an amazing job. I just don't know if this is actually where we're in the head in future. It'll be really interesting to see if this is what people want. Let me know if this is the future you want where there's no one driving and we are just all kind of relax in this kind of studio setting. Is this what's gonna happen? Let me know in the comments and a massive thank you to Lincoln for showing us around. This is just incredible. Make sure you like the video and subscribe to Supercar Blondie. We have got the craziest stuff coming this week. You do not wanna miss out. All right, we're out. Love you, bye. All right, we're gonna get out. <laughs> Let me open. There we go. All right.